She's a Mona Lisa Everyone's lining up to see her She's a Mona Lisa Everyone's lining up to see her There must be something Hey guys, so today I'm gonna be showing you guys my new skincare routine. This is my night routine. Um, it is updated, it's changed a lot since we've talked last. I kind of went for more of that minimal approach, which I know is kind of where everyone's trying to go, but then also like with TikTok and all these cool products that we all wanna use, it's really hard to just like stay with the minimal. So I've been really trying these past few months. I'll show you guys my skin afterwards. Right now I have makeup because I just got back from work. Yeah, it's a, it's a hard life. I work one day a week. But, anyway, let's start with taking all this makeup off because I don't usually wear this much makeup and I'm not a huge fan. Also, guys, like and subscribe. I post once a week. I try to post every single Monday for Madeline Mondays. Um, I post lifestyle and how-tos. And I really like doing vlogs. So I'm still trying to find my style. So comment below ideas of videos that I should try and like and subscribe for future things. Alright, so to take off my makeup, I've used this... Now, I'm probably going to butcher every single name. Okay, so I just want to put that out there. I probably butcher everything. Versed? Comment below if I mess up, okay? Versed, I guess? Maybe this? It's a day dissolve cleansing balm. Eucalyptus oil and vitamin E. So it just kind of looks like this. And what I'll do is I will just take a little bit, which I barely wear makeup, so this isn't something I do every single night, but like I said, I wore a lot of makeup today, so I will just put this on my face, and it just kind of melts the makeup, to be honest with you. Like all of it, if I leave it, sometimes I'll leave it on for a little bit and just like watch it melt. Um, but I really like how my skin feels after this. And I really think it gets the product off well. Um, I also just like, I feel better afterwards. Like I really feel like all my makeup's off, all the day is gone, like it really does the job. Um, so honestly, 10 out of 10 recommend that product. See, like, I don't know if you guys can tell. Like, it's all, like, running down. So, I'm going to go ahead and wash that off now. Oh! Ooh. I try to not use a washcloth because I know how bad that is for your face. Um, I usually, honestly, if I wash my face in the shower, which, once again, I try to not do. But if I wash my face in the shower... I will try to um, use a washcloth if I put on makeup because it just, I feel like it gets off everything, you know, more. But at the same time, I do know it tugs your face. So I really try to not use a washcloth as much as I can. But for this, as you can tell, I'm going to actually have to use a washcloth because it's not fully getting off because I wore extreme makeup today. So I am going to go ahead and get a washcloth and take everything off and just make sure that it is officially off my face. I switched stuff around a little bit. Um, for the past two weeks I've been using this. I got a little mini to see if I like it, but I really do like the feeling of it. It's kind of like a creamy texture. Um, so I get the Gentle Skin Cleanser from Cetaphil. And then every other night I use my um, facial brush. Now I'm probably going to mispronounce this too. Duval, Duvalet? Duvalet? D-U... It's D-U-V... D-U-V-O-L-L-E. But anyway really really like this brush now i got this like a week ago and i am in love with it so i wanted to tell you guys about it so not only does it come with this but like this is like the normal cleansing like wait let me show you that's like the normal one but it also comes with an exfoliating and it'll come with a body one which i have a lot of like back acne so that's definitely very very helpful for me really really big fan of this um shout out to Duvalet, Duvalet for sending it to me. Um, I really, really appreciate it. If you guys want to try it, I have my code down there in the bottom. Feel free to use my code below and get some money off. And um, it's definitely worth it. So then I put some on there, which was a little too much. But anyway, yeah, I originally was using the uh, the bottle that you could like squirt on. But like I said, I used to use this and I did it for a while and I was going to go back. So I used this. It's just so gentle. Like, I used to use a Clarisonic cleanser, and it was so rough with my skin, and this one is just so gentle, and it feels so good. I definitely recommend, and I have very sensitive skin, so if I'm saying that, head to the store. <laughs> 
I just kind of wet it and I go through and do it again once it's wet. So that is that and then I just leave it out to dry and then I wash off my, <laughs> and I wash off my face. And then I get my towel and I always dab. <laughs> I always pat, don't rub. Okay, so after that, all my stuff is off. It's pretty, just like a clear face. I said pretty. That's just pretty clear is what I was trying to say. So then I have been using this amazing thing that I found on TikTok. And it is L N S L M D salicylic acid body spray. So I use this just like a spritz before bed, but I also use it on my mask and it helps out with maskiny. And I also just use it like all over my face in the middle of the day. Same thing with my back. Been a huge lifesaver. So I just spray that one time. No biggie. No stress. And then I use my CeraVe daily moisturizing lotion. I would die without this stuff. Seriously, it is so light. And I love it. I always make sure to like rub it in my face really good. Alrighty guys, so that is my updated skincare routine. That's literally all. Then I will sometimes put on um, the ordinary caffeine solution underneath my eyes. I'll do that like every other day. Sometimes I'll do it at night, sometimes I'll do it in the morning. That one's kind of a little bit less, um, but I will show you guys my updated morning routine probably next week. Um, but I'm just trying to be more simple because I found that that makes my skin a lot better because I have very sensitive skin, so the less, the better. Um, I would like to incorporate a toner, but I also don't want to do too much. So comment below if you guys know any toners below. Comment below if you know any toners, period, not below 10 times. Um, but I'm going to go ahead and get in the bath and just have a really relaxing night. So glad I got to do my skincare with you guys. Comment below any other sensitive, you know, skincare options. I do love a routine, but I am trying to be as minimal as possible. So thanks guys. I will see you guys later. Bye.